Hey guys, how's it going? It's Kyle Dittman here from Bullion RV in beautiful Duluth, Minnesota. Today for you we have the Montana High Country 377 FL from Keystone. We're going to get you around the outside, we'll bring you onto the inside and see what you think. Alright, first thing I want to show you is the nice big awning out front with the LED under it. Really going to light up that campsite at night. It doesn't look like much on the inside, but when you get it out on the campsite, it really does a lot. Up top, you got your speakers, outdoor speakers for you. You got two of them up there. Windows everywhere. Get yourself a 12 gallon water heater on the dual axle with a six point auto leveling jack system. I'll show you the storage. I'm gonna this back one first here. On the back with the slam closed baggage locks and the magnetic hold so you're not breaking any latches. All right. We got storage up front here. When we get you on the other side, there's a motion sensor light that'll come on for you. It's really nice. LP tank, 30 pounder, one on the other side as well. We'll get you in the front, chuck it up here. Nice front cap with the rounded edges. Let's all the weather roll right off of there. With the lights on the front, looks really nice. You got your road armor, trail air, inch rubber, nice smooth ride. All right, tuck you under here. More storage right up front with a great light. This is one of the other slides from the living room that really opens it up. We'll get you in there. There's your auto leveling system. You got a 30 pound tank. Walk around the light just comes on. This is the other side with the inverter. Outdoor shower, hot cold water, battery disconnect stuff right there another big slide from the kitchen we're gonna sneak around here we're kind of tight we'll bring around back of the unit real fast on the back side here we got more storage on the back on the bottom with the ladder that walks up to the walkable roof and your backup camera prep up there We'll bring it around and get you on the back side of this unit has a ladder and a door, which is really rare to see. You got the nice safety step ladders come all the way down to the ground. Nice, solid, sturdy walk up for you. As you can see, these motion lights are kind of all throughout the whole camper here. They just kind of come on when you walk by. And we're going to bring you into the sweetest spot up top into the bunk area, the hideout, the getaway. It is for the grandkids. If you got pets, I know my dogs would probably run up here and this would be their spot. It's just a great little area, big, big space. You know, if I was a you know kid, this, this is where I would live all weekend, all week, however long you're at the campsite. It does have an AC unit up here to keep it cool. So you don't gotta worry about this just being a little hot box. In the corner there, you got your cable, you got your 110, so you can put a TV up here if you want. A couple windows up there to make it feel nice and open. You don't get super claustrophobic. Nice safety guard rail here so the kids aren't falling out. Let me show you that. And bring it back down. Since we're talking sleeping cool areas, we're gonna bring you into the big bedroom with the king size bed. Master bed, you can see that light pop on there. Motion sensor into the big wardrobe with the sliding doors. Just goes deep on both sides. Big bed that folds up into more under storage. And the bed just holds up all by itself. I'm not touching it, it's just hanging out which is really nice feature. You got under all that storage under there. Hose for the central vac, where we'll show you where that is. Just push it down. I mean, anybody can lift this up. I do it with one arm. 
place to hook up your TV. You got USB on this side. You got the 110 on the other side. So you do got power all over this unit. You got 110 there and 110 on the side of this dresser. So you can plug in anything you need in here. Drawers upon drawers. And then you got a nice big cabinet here. It opens up and if you want, open this up, give it a little more light you can see. You got more 110 in there and then you do have a washer dryer prep for that all-in-one washer dryer if you wanted to choose to put one of those in there. It's all set for you. All right, we'll walk you around. We'll kind of work this unit backwards on this one. We got the bathroom for you. With a nice porcelain stool here, foot flush. Huge, tall shower. Look at that. Huge. There's nobody that's gonna hit their head in there. You get your towel rack all ready for you to go. And it's got the seat. Look at that. My shower at home doesn't even have a seat. My wife would love that feature. I love that feature. Sometimes I just want to sit down in the shower and just let the water hit me. And that is perfect. Got the medicine cabinet here. Storage behind it. Nice beautiful sink in the and here with all the storage you need under the sink. And then you do have an outlet in here as well. All right, and the fan right up top. We'll kind of bring you in closer if you can see the little blue umbrella, which is gonna indicate the auto shut. If it starts raining while you're away from this unit, don't worry, that will shut for you. You won't have any water coming in. It's an awesome little feature. All right, bring you up into the kitchen here. Now the kitchen is big, open, airy space. It just feels so inviting. You got a nice bar top here to mix up your cocktails, to serve up your breakfast. I mean, dinner time, it's just, you know, I showed you where the kids play. This is where the grown-ups play. You got your bar stools here with a nice light under to kind of give you that awesome feel. We'll move this stool. You can tuck your shoes, a little more storage there, whatever you kind of want. But it's nice to have that right when you walk in, you know, then you're not tracking all the dirt throughout. But I did say that this has a central vac, so that's right down there. And it doesn't have really any carpet in here, so, you know, you don't have to worry about that kind of quick clean. But it is there. Up front, you can see through this door all the blue lights. This is your motherboard. You know, you got your heated holding tanks, all the slides you got your fan switch there's going to be the ceiling fan up here you got that right down here and then more storage throughout this whole cabinet and then again it gives you this nice top up here you know you set more cocktails you know if your dogs kind of try to get up on the countertop. You got a little higher countertop to put things up there that they can't get at. Nice dinette table here, four chairs, and a pullout. Gives you an extra, little extra in case you're doing that puzzle that's too big on a rainy day, playing cards, anything. Add that extra little space in there. Big windows everywhere. Beautiful GE microwave and a huge oven. Look at that. I'm gonna fit turkey inside that bad boy. And storage all around. So you got storage above there, storage over here, and above the sink, you got your stainless steel sink with a two sided sink. It's really nice to have that. You can get storage under it. And then this one does come with sink covers. 
that are tucked under there. So if you wanted to add more counter space, the sink covers will go over there and add you that more counter space there. You got a four drawer pull out system on this side. All those pull out. All right, and look at this stainless steel GE fridge freezer. Just huge. It is awesome. Pan back. Then we'll bring you up into the entertainment area. So this section here is beautiful. You got the dual sided on the dual on the dual slides. You got the two couches that do pull out into beds. Back here, I'm just hanging out in front of the fireplace on the power reclining chairs that do have little USBs. I can bring it down here. These little USBs here by the control systems. Cup holders there. You got your AC, another AC unit, right? You got your AC unit right up here. Keep it, and this one's a nice quiet AC unit in here. You got your all-in-one CD, DVD, auxiliary, everything right up front there with the TV. And then this TV just drops down into here. So it's gonna be out of there. Pan bag and show you all the space from up top here, kind of. You're looking down from like a raised living room area. It's a beautiful kind of look down on the whole camper, the whole team. Everybody's hanging out in here. We'll bring you back and we'll show you that big front window that we can kind of hardly see from the outside. That'll show you out to the campground, keep an eye on everybody outside. I mean, this thing's just got windows everywhere. It's got the really nice light interior to keep it bright and inviting. All right, we'll bring you back in the kitchen. This is where I feel like I love it. Again, my name is Kyle Dimon. I'm up here with Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. If you have any questions about this unit or any other unit that we have in our lot, please feel free to text or call me anytime at 320-290-5834. And remember, happy camping.